good enough for Mike Tyson's pigeons, good enough for me. Thumbnail pick. Sideshow. Sideshow Bob. I think I did this. There you go. Kind of went like that for the thumbnail pick. Let's recreate it. See how long I can stand there like one of the guys at the fucking airport? You ever seen they do this? had to untangle it looking good thanks there's a trick to keeping your hair from getting tangled you take it you twist it up you gotta twist it this is gonna be a mess when I go to comb it I'm gonna take out a chunk rat's nest How's everyone today? Just want to mention uh, when people place the orders on the website and they put a message, I do read them and I appreciate the messages. I get a lot of really nice messages. I'm reading them. I say thank you. Appreciate them. Some kind words and comments. And then, like, if I make a mistake on your order, let me know. Pretty good. How's the farm? Is good. Hot. Hot man. Make sure I got my list. Do I got my list? No, I don't got my list. You can't get shit done without your list. You gotta find the list. I'm looking for a dime. That's top of the line. What's up, Chato? How you doing? Here we are. We're about to ship out orders. Walking my way outside. You know, I could take this extra step and put another hat on. Are we on. gonna do another uh, egg breakfast with Clark? <laughs> when, I, when I wake up early enough. That's true though. What this thing's in. You know, Clark, may I ask you a favor? Huh. You can take that pot off it of, to get that rack. You know that cart? That. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. There's just set whatever's there right on the ground. These things are great right here. They lower the temperature. But I'm going to get one more of them. But things are pretty good around here as far as like watering goes. We're all caught up on the watering schedule. Next we need to weed, fertilize, uh, repot. Um, look at this hybrid, hybrid fruit here, Clark. Nice. Wanna try one? Yeah. See if we can get it off. This is a hybrid between the, uh, let me look at it real quick. Trunk of flora and the red. And from what I remember, it tastes just like a red, except the pulp is thicker. Don't eat the skin. If you want it, you can have the seed. You can keep it, yeah. What What do you think, the flavor? Just like a red? Tastes like jibotacaba. Yeah, but just like a red, pretty much. Yeah. That's why I'm not 
I mean, the the skin was kind of thick. Yeah, hell yeah, the skin gets thicker. Yeah, but it's cool that nothing stole it. It's a really attractive tree. Attractive tree. This one I picked a little early. Let's taste it. Thank you. Mm, mm, yeah. Is that the first fruit? No. The pulp's thick. How's your kombucha? Split. Oh. I put. I pulled. I brought it in the house. Yeah, I chato asked at the same time. It split. I brought it in the house. But I got this one over here that's still holding on. This one's getting really big. Yeah, it is. Size of that freaking thing. And so, careful not to overwater it, but it's got to be watered. Yeah. But I, I may have overwatered the other one, or it just got too, got too hot, I think. It was too hot. We've been laying down a lot of water. Yeah, but I mean, fuck, it was either that or... The tree's gonna dry up, you know, like. Shit, it's hot right now, huh? 90 for sure. Yeah. A lot of dieback and fungus out there in that grove. Really bad year for growing. The year before was a lot better. Drought year. <clears throat> I'm looking for a dime. That's top of the line. I cut that thing back. It looks like it's going to die. It needs water, I think. I think this hose reaches. You know what I mean? Yeah. Look at this little guy. What happened with that? Oh, I was going to take it over. Those are my little low pots. Oh, those are yours. Ooh, it's hot in here. All right, let's see what's on this. It's in here. get bigger don't they not much probably on someone else's tree so i need um like try one of these with the miracle fruit yeah it's pretty good i've done it hot. hot in here i'm looking for a dime that's top of the line I'm going to do a little hand water. Okay. I need one of these. Sorry, guys. Give me one second. I got to set you there. Looking at the roots on these. Bone's getting a little wet. This one looks good. That's one of the $50 echo sweet cuttings from the website sorry uh. okay got that one of those Let's see what else we got on the list we need these Kaylee Cena's those are in the other house Dovialis is in the other house. Lemon drop plugs are in the other house. Everything else is in the other house. We'll go in the other house. Hopefully we don't lose connection because that happens a lot in the other house. If we do, if we lose connection, I will be back. I'm just gonna go walk over to the house and um, I'll walk over to the house and do my shipping over there. But we're gonna have fun. We're gonna play games. There's gonna be cash prizes. There's going to be dancers there. Yeah, man. Look at this tree right here. Got hit by the heat, I guess, one day. Look at how it got smoked. You see that? That's called getting smoked. Must have been like a fungus heat thing going on there. But it needs more shade and less heat. One day must have got too hot. Ooh, it's hot in here right now. Alrighty. We're looking for some lemon drop plugs. We're going to need one, two, three, four lemon drop plugs. And some Patanga tuba plugs. All right. Let's see what we got over here. These are some nice ones here. One, two, 
Ah, and we'll have a third one here. Sorry, I'm not filming too good. If I hold the camera up, it's gonna go off. There you go. Thanks. Let's so hold those up for the camera real quick. Those are some nice Batanga tuba plugs. Look at the height on them. Okay, let's keep going. I got my rack out there in front of the greenhouse. Yeah. Okay. Patanga tuba plug one. It's like only one Patanga. <laughs> That's not smart, is it? Uh, lemon drop mango steam plugs one, two, three, four. Kalecina plugs four. Red Jabbity Kaba plugs four. Shit, I hope the stream doesn't give out on us. I hope everyone's doing really well, too. I'm doing good. These things are really well rooted. Three and four. Gotta get an extra one now. Look at the weeds fucking pulled it apart. Can you get that weed? And we'll get two more extras here. There we go. Lemon drop mango scene. Oh, Eugenia Kaylee scene as I remember these. Four of these stupid things. One. Two. Three. And four, that was easy enough. Yeah, those are big. Uh, ah, there. Okay. One, two, three, and this one's pretty yellow. We'll throw it in as an extra. an extra two. All right. I just need a Dovey Alice and we're out of here, I think. Ah! What? No, I think that's not something different. I'm just going to grab a couple and we'll figure it out when we get it over there. You get like three all at once. Connection or something. It says I went to shit. Says my viewership plummeted. Plummetsville, USA. See, this is one of those Grimmel hybrids right here that looks really, really nice, I believe. Yeah, that's one. I just gotta make sure it's not crawling with bugs or anything before it goes out. That's a really nice tall one here. I'm gonna go get a good look at it and make sure it's super clean. And then maybe I can ship it. We're back. Yeah, it didn't even let me know. It didn't even tell me it cut off. The connection should be good now. Yeah, some of these trees need to have the soil kind of looked at. Looks relatively clean. This is a nice one. My eyes are so bad anymore, it's like I need full sunlight to be able to see anything. Yeah, this thing's ready to grow.
sit and watch it for a minute. Clean. I just sit out here. Do it. No, I can't take it too long. Yeah, fuck it. We'll go inside. I just pulled everything out there, but I think inside's gonna have better receptivity. Okay, we got good connection now. We're on the Wi-Fi. All right, this is how you wrap them up. You take the plant, grab it, start wrapping. Wicked, 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 wicked. Beat someone with that. Come here, boy. Bah. Bah. American gladiators, but with wrapped plants as weapons. That would be cool. American nursery gladiators. It's too dark in here. He beat the shit out of me with a one gallon plastic wrap planilla. <laughs> the roof ball was so solid, dude. You could feel it. Doggy. I'm a simple man. That's Keegan's punchline. Big trees. A tanga tuba, nice one. Red Javity Cabo plugs, huh? What do you say? You guys ever watch the Ron Popeil infomercials? I love that shit. He's such a smug asshole. But when he sells something, it makes me like shit. I'm thinking about buying something right now. I need some Ronco something. I love that shit, man. Anyone else? Ronco? Infomercials? You feeling it? Is that just me? I could sit and watch them for just hours. The one with this cousin Eddie or whatever with the knife? Dude, if you have time, sit down and watch that guy sell you on knives. 
if I could have them here at the farm uh, online selling for me, especially that, that guy's probably dead, but he would have been so good. Nobody, huh? This generation doesn't care about Ron Cole and all the wonderful inventions that he uh, brought to us. A oh, what? A oh, what? This one kind of got fucked, so someone will get it for free. I think I pulled a few too many fruit trees today, but I know what I'm doing. I'm not that stupid. Well, maybe I am, but this is a nice tree here. Red Jabba de Cabo plug, $15. Wholesale for local pickup, we can do you about half of that. $7, huh? Think about that. Get you a couple hundred. Seven dollars. I could probably lower the price if you got even more. But not too much. I, I don't think I would sell this tree for less than about seven dollars. Seven to eight, uh, seven dollars. Done some for five, but it's when you're buying a thousand of them. I think I've got a wholesale order, hopefully, for quite a few. Some of these, who knows, they could be a little bit hybridized, too. It's like a weather forecast. I give these, like, a... 10% chance of hybridization, maybe less. I should say 5% to 3% is high. So we'll give it a a 3% chance. But mutations are always possible too. Yeah, I think your chances of getting something strange are in the 1 to 3% range. But some of these, they're variable. They are, you start to notice a little bit of variation. Just as far as the leaves go. So you throw a little extra one in here with this lemon drop mango steam. There's one bare root thrown in with it. Hopefully someone notices that extra tree there. Okay. We're keeping it moving. All right, guys. Here's another one here. Lemon drop mango steam. The $25 haulers on the website. Superior type. Trying to throw extras in when I can. Sometimes there'll be one that when I go to pull it out, it like gets bare rooted a little bit and I'll be like, ah, fuck, they can have it for free. I'll throw it in extra if I can. Sometimes it happens, not all the time. I feel like I say that and someone's going to get their order and be like, There's nothing, nothing came extra. Yeah, I, I do it when I can. Definitely on the seeds though. You got to throw a couple extra, three extra at least on the seeds, extras. We're getting to the bottom of this. Almost done. How's everyone doing today? Oh, that's a nice tree. <laughs> yeah, whoever said that. Yeah, that's right. Who knows if it was rats, but some creature got, got your fruit. <laughs> yeah, I knew it was going to happen too. I got one picked, and I was like, you know what? I better just go ahead and pick the rest today. I waited till the next day, gone. I was like, oh shit, there's enough to, to fill two or three boxes. I filled one box and then I couldn't fill, I had to refund two people's orders. Um, probably should have just sent a message and asked if you wanted me to keep the money until I had the fruit again. That way I, I know I'm gonna have it again. I just don't like holding on to people's money and having to remember sucks that's a really nice tree right here yeah you can poke a couple of holes in this and just throw it into plastic that's what I do just cut a hole at the top, pop, pop, throw it in there. I know, that sucks. Yeah, this is one of the um, Echo, Echo Sweet. I don't have a lot of these left, but I have some. These look really good. They're really strong. 
they look like shit for a few year for like not a, a year and then yeah this is one of the um Grimmel hybrids sabra Grimmel hybrids this is like a tall kind of lanky one i picked it out because i like the way it looked it's nice and tall the others are not quite as tall usually shit i got some that i'm selling that are half the height but th they're just bushier trees so that's all put together now we got these lemon drop mangosteen seeds over here we got to put these in boxes and they've dried out and they're clean looking really good can't let them dry too much but these are strong seeds where they can dry for a couple weeks easy but i've let these dry just for a little bit they need to go in a big bag all righty see i shaved my armpits guys just kidding the hair just doesn't grow in i like to tease people and tell them i shave them <laughs> okay 10 lemon drop mango steam seeds and this person gets a little bonus they must have said something nice in the comments one two three four five one two three four five these might need a, a pinch of water i'll leave that open number one okay who else got lemon drop seeds Okay, buddy, let's get you some extras. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Get you come extra in there. Okay. Another bag there, okay. Who's next? Lemon drop mangosteen seeds. We got, okay, last bag. All right, everybody's getting extras today. All right, there's five. Another four, and then another four or five. That's more than 10. Tell your friend. Let's count them. I never even count them. One, two, three, four, five. That's more than 10. Okay. Very cool. Now these need to go into one big bag. And they need a, a, a little bit of moisture, probably. They're just at the verge of getting dry. But you see, the seeds have moisture in them already. It's like an egg. An egg doesn't just dry out, it has a shell. An embryo. Takes a while for the egg to dry out. These are tree eggs. You ever thought of it that way? Like an egg that come out of a tree. Some of them really do look like a little egg. I love it. It's like an Easter egg hunt. Every day of my life, Easter eggs, Easter eggs. You just don't paint them or nothing. You put them in a bag. Don't let them get, you gotta let them dry, but don't let them get too dry. Okay. And right now I'm just grabbing what I have left. These are valuable little seeds, believe it or not. They grow fruit. You can eat the fruit. Um, a lot of perlite left over. We're just getting out any seeds that are valuable here. These are my extras. Little crumb ones here. Who knows, one of these could be variegated. I've had it happen. It's rare. But I do have a variegated one out there. I don't think it's the superior type. It's the regular lemon drop mango steam. Okay. Alright, I think we're good on this. One more seed maybe. Oh, found a big one that I was missing. Wow. All right, now we're about good. Always one that you miss, you know? All right, that's good. Oh, all right. Good deal. Mm. That's what we were able to pull out. Need a little bit of water in there. I don't know, I'd say there's still a good 40, 50 seeds in there. That'll go right there for now. Let's go ahead and label the seeds with a pen, a marker. Got markers in here. We'll just write lemon drop superior. Lemon 
M1 drop superior. I think I didn't spell superior right. Superior lemon drop. Yeah, these could take a spritz of water. Okay. Now it's getting time to pack everything up. I feel like I'm, I am missing something. Dovey Alice. That's out front. Dovey Alice is out front. Hold on one second. <clears throat> oh, shit. Thanks for waiting. 14 of you. Thank you. Oh, a little weed there. Can't. Oh, that's not a weed. That's part of the tree. I almost tried to pull it. Oh, don't get your shirt dirty. Uh, Dovey Alice. Nice tropical apricot. These are rooted cuttings, so they'll fruit quick. Oh, yeah. That's a tall one. Hopefully it fits in the box. So you could take it and bend it about that far before it breaks. Breaking point is right there. Crack. Then you gotta go get another one. Everything's wrapped up. Now I've gotta label everything and put it in the appropriate size boxes. So whatever goes in a small, go right now small well, flat rate box commonly used in the industry One second, I gotta go grab a, a water spray bottle. I feel bad sending these out dry. I know they'll be fine, but.
They definitely got extra seeds. One down. Okay. A tuba in a red. All right. If you're shipping to Florida, it's cheaper to use this box than a small flat rate box. Isn't that stupid? So all I got to do, if I want to save a dollar, put it in this box. I think it may be... Sometimes it's not even a dollar. We'll see. It's a bigger box. Doesn't make any sense. This isn't flat rate. But it is only for priority mail. So this person got a tuba and a red. So we'll get a, a really nice Patanga tuba and a nice red. And there's an extra red. They can have that one somewhere in here looking like shit. There it is. Yeah. So let's put these together. And put this in. And then label it. Just hang good. Too bad I don't have the stickers anymore. Remember the stickers? Those were the good old days. The days of old. When we had stickers, yeah? What did I do with that magazine? That was perfect. There it is. This is a good material to wrap with. Trees like it. Very soft. Big pieces of paper. This is a lot better than a Uline catalog. This is an Orlando Weekly. You can get me some more old Orlando Weeklies, I could use them. Great packing material. They give them out for free. I need to go grab like a whole stack. Just kidding. Orlando Weekly would be mad at that. If I grabbed their whole rack of newspapers and used them for fucking packing supplies. I just bought, I grabbed one, all right? Sorry, Orlando Weekly. I, I I read it too. Not even a pound, so that's thirteen ounces. Thirteen ounces. Okay. We got 10 lemon drop seeds. Now here's what I wonder. This is the big question right here. Here's the big question. I don't think I'm gonna ask the question actually. But I'm like, well, I was gonna try to fit this tree in this box, but I'm gonna fit it in this box. I don't wanna squeeze it down. I'll give it the space. I think they paid, yeah, they paid a lot for shipping, so I gotta hook these people up. We're gonna hook you up. Oh yeah, you get extra seeds for sure. I'll make sure to throw in even more, because I see you paid 15 for shipping, and you're in Florida. You could have gotten away with paying nine, but you're generous, so now I gotta hit you back. I'll take care of you. I'll probably end up paying 
about nine or ten dollars to ship this. So let's take a look. I got seeds, lemon drop. I'm gonna add a couple more in here for you. You did get some lemon drop seeds. Yeah, we'll put you four more. How about that? I'll raise you four. There you go. Thank you. Okay, now we need to get four Kaleesinas. One, two, three, four. And these are a lot bigger than the other ones. I think I raised the price on them. So they're bigger now. So we take these. We're going to bundle them up like that. We're going to label them. Eugenia Kaleesina. Okay. Got them. We got that. Now we need a Grimmel Hybrid. Grimmel Sabra Hybrid. Grimmel X Sabra. No name. I can't name a hundred different varieties of the same fucking tree. All right. And then we need, uh, that's it. Now we need some sticks in this bitch. Sticks in this motherfucker. All right, they fit perfect. I just need my clippers in this motherfucker. All right, put that. All right. Now let's get everything taped up. Get some clear tape in this motherfucker. All right, clear tape. Got this one secured. All right, secure. Ah. Oh. Next, we're gonna need stick on this motherfucker right here. Okay. Boom. Get that here. All right. We're making way, making progress in this motherfucker. All right. Okay. Next, we're gonna need to see this motherfucker this piece of paper. All right. Okay, help me now. Help me. A little help. Come on now. See, this will keep the plastic from sticking to the tape. And when he goes to unbag it, he'll just be, it won't rip the plastic. Okay? So we're going to take this up in this motherfucker. Right now like that. Okay. Take that over here. Don't stick the leaves to it. And stick it on like chat chair. A little bit won't take in this motherfucker. All right. Probably gonna crimp off the top. And then we're gonna bring it all together like peaches and cream. Just like that. Oh, it jumped in the box. And then we're gonna, yeah. And then we're gonna need a, a little bit of packing materials in this right here. Okay. Where'd that one go? I like that one. Yeah. Still shipping plants. Maybe one day I'll go back and I'll go back and look at these tapes and be like, man, we used to ship a bunch of plants, dog. Woo! Two pounds, six ounces. Fifteen nine six. Two pounds, six ounces. Fifteen nine six. All right, we're making our way to the finish line here, guys. Who's next? Echo Sweet. 
going to Florida. This one can fit in this box easily. Take it. Those will cut your foot if you drop them on your foot. If you work rushed, bad things can happen when you're in a rush. But I like to be in a rush. I'm in a rush. You know us. that tape kink so you can find it the next time. Oh goodness me. Alright, let's see how this fits in this little box here. Beautifully. Then you gotta stuff it with paper. Coastal Angler and this. Oh, hold on, one more look at this. Oh yeah, babe, look at that fucking snip. Shit. Wow, haul ass sea bass. Uh, not right now. Not right now. Come on, baby. Oh, that's a nice knife. Come on, Bubba. $79. Okay. Oh, that's a huge... That's a huge hogfish. I'm sorry, Barbara. It's huge home fish. That weighs close to two pounds. One pound, 13 ounces. Yeah, they are good, passionate fruit. One Echo Sweet, one pound, 13 ounces, seven by six. What's going on with that? You know what? I think this guy That's some nice stuff to say or something. Sometimes I forget. Throw these guys a little something extra. iPhone storage is full, huh?
Got it. All right, we're getting down to the final stretch. Who's next? Ten lemon drop seeds. This is going to be interesting. What's the we're we going to? Okay, so we're going to need a uh, small flat ray box. We're going to see what we can fit in this small flat. Farm's doing great. Thanks for asking. Appreciate that. Now I'm about to try to squeeze a bunch of shit in this little box to save on shipping. Let's see how this works out. First, we're going to have to label everything. Well, yeah, before we put it in the box. So what do we have going in? We got two red plugs and three lemon drop mango steam plugs. Okay. Okay. Here. You're jamming, man. Jamming. So I was say I would pay someone to do this, but it doesn't make sense. You gotta be. It's like I do it so fast. I'm not gonna. I can't sit and like. I mean, a real businessman would figure out a way to get this done. Okay. They say, hey, Clark, North Florida Bear. Hey! Hey! There's three lemon drop mangosteen plugs. And then they got two red Jabbity Cabo plugs. Yeah, that's extra, too. So let's give them the nicest we got. Two. These are nice. Two reds. You can't fit more than five in a box. Full size plugs. This is cutting it close. Gonna probably have to bring it around this way. Yep. And then this is kind of tucked in here like this. Okay, now I need the seeds. Lemon drop mango seed seeds, 10, yeah, yeah, uh, like that. And then even a piece of paper. Nice little package. Yeah, and it saved me on shipping. I just don't want to break these little leaves up too bad. Like that, you gotta fold them over just right. Just goes like that, and like that. As long as you don't hear anything break, you're good. Oh gosh, I need that Bob Marley lice treatment. Okay, whose name goes on that box? Let's find out. Brian, thank you Brian, I got your message. I left out a tree, so I sent him an extra one. He ordered again. And this is the last one. The last box. And I have all these extra trees. Why do I have so many extra trees? All right, I think this is gonna make sense to fit in this box if I can, but I don't know if this tree's gonna bend to fit in this box. We'll have to see. Might have to use a totally different box. Joe Alice? Yeah. I don't know if it's going to hook around like that. Let's see. Let's get some sticks cut for it. Unfortunate truth. We 
when you're looking to save a buck on shipping. I saw a couple of inches of fruit on them. Out there, really? Yeah. Oh, I should have grabbed them. Very well. Now let's see how it fits together. I literally, I literally did like coil it around and then and now it needs to be stuffed with paper. We'll call that uh, one pound, 10 ounces, seven by six. One pound, 10 ounces, seven by six. Eduardo. Very good. And these are the extra plants I pulled. I don't know why I pulled so many of these by accident, I pulled too many. Batanga tuba plugs. Yeah, what, what's up with that? tuba. Only got one and I gave him an extra. Looking good. Now I just got to shit. Oh. Need to run that freeze dryer again soon. Just where we started is where I think we're going to end up. A new bottle of Fiji. Another time of me telling you that I'm just as good as one of Mike Tyson's pigeons. If not, maybe a little better. Fiji water. Thanks for watching. And we probably gotta go out and water and I'll wait, I'll wait to print my shipping labels. It's only noon. I got, I can wait a while to print these labels. I'll wait a minute. Yeah, thanks for watching the auctions end tonight on eBay. And then we'll list again tomorrow for sure. On, on Thursday, we'll do listings again. Remember, if you do get anything on the website, okay, email, is it? Nice. 
email flying fox fruits at gmail.com flying fox fruits at gmail.com for local pickup and make the title of your email local pickup I'm actually responding to people I've got a lot of planillas Tanga tubas, nothing grafted, seedlings for local pickup, cheaper prices than on website, wholesale price, minimum orders like 75, 70 bucks. We'd like to say 100, but I'm, I, I'm not going to, $30 difference, you know, 70 is about the mark to where I need to be at, where I can come out and spend, you know, 15 20 minutes. I don't want to do that, but sometimes we have to do that. Okay. Sometimes you got to do it. 15, 20 minutes outside goes by really fast. But I, I can usually spend 15, 20 minutes real quick. 15, 10. Depends how hot it is, you know? Chicken's bugging out. I know what chicken that is. I bet you that's Peach White Owl. Let's go take a look. I can just hear her voice. That's Peach White Owl. That's Peach White Owl. No, it wasn't. It was this gorilla ass chicken. There's eggs everywhere, look. Barbara, penguin, come on inside, I don't remember, maybe, it's probably getting too hot and fungusy, alright, I'm going to go out there and check on it. Well, we I, it's all done, and now I've got to um, print the labels. But it's it's noon, and I'm gonna and so I, I'm gonna wait a couple hours to print the yeah. labels. All right, good. Nice. Lemon drop mango seeds growing. Nice. Thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate you. Have a great day.